people come up to me and say, how old are you? And I say, old enough to know better and too young to give a rat's ass about it. <laughs> I came up here from Manly, so I was always a beach girl anyway. And in Manly, I started the topless thing on Manly Beach. So of course I went through with it up here as well. And nude sunbaking if I go around Belongio. The name Feather came about. I jumped in the shower and a feather was on the floor, a white feather. And that was strange. I kept it, I've still got it to this day. So hence the feathers, everywhere. <laughs> and then some people in town still call me Lorraine. I think, oops, mum's around, I better be open, so. <laughs> I started dancing when I was maybe seven. I did tap, I didn't want to do ballet. Ballet was too quiet. Then I came up here and I met a lady who'd been a tap dancer and she said she wanted to start a group of over 50 tap dancers. We were called the Bay Bells. And um, I stayed with her for about 10 years. And then all of a sudden, I didn't want to do structured dancing anymore. I got into the pub scene. If a Friday night, it could be raining or storming, and I think, oh, I won't go tonight. And I say, no, get yourself dressed and get out there, because it's too easy to stay at home. I hear a lot of women say, I can't be bothered anymore. That's part of it, is getting out and getting dressed and looking your best, and meeting people. You're not going to meet anybody sitting at home in a chair. No, I think it's wonderful. I've reinvented myself. <laughs> Makes me feel alive. Dancing just gives that extra special. It's the music, the movement, and it's the people around you as well. Yeah, everyone's got a smile on their face and everyone's happy, yeah. Life is a challenge, and you've got to rise up to the challenge. And don't be defined by your age. Don't say no to anything, just say yes to everything. And that's why I'm doing this, because I said yes. <laughs>